hello hello right okay i thought i'd do a kitting up video so i have quite a few different canvases to kit up i thought you know i just need to start working my way through this i've pulled out all the drills that's the box is ready and waiting this should be fun not really <laughs> you can hear rio in the background he's got a lot to say about nothing this morning i'm only going to kit up one of them with you this morning because it's going to take me all day it'd be like a an hour long video so i'm just going to prop you up looking down somewhere if i can like so while i um while i kit up guys should be fun never done a kitting well i did do one the other day tell a lie so i'm gonna start with this lovely cactus bubble shape one yeah i did one the other day but unfortunately somebody walked in ruined it for me so i thought there's absolutely no way i can put that up because you know sometimes it just doesn't happen so right i'm gonna choose 21 colors on this one so i think I will choose one that is, get my little handy unicorn pen, there she is, and I get the scissors, 21 colours, should be able to get away with a smallish container, so I think I may try, I haven't tried these ones yet. Shall we give them a whirl? Yeah, let's give them a whirl. I've never tried these. So these are un undone. The thing that puts me off with these is, I don't know, I feel like the containers themselves might be a bit too small. You know? I could be wrong. But let's have a go and see. He is so noisy this morning, guys. It's unreal. Just checking, double checking the canvas number. Z013. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Okay. So, I mean, you know, I mean, really, realistically, I don't know how much I'm actually going to get into these. They could surprise me, but I very much don't think they will. Yeah, I don't think these are going to be sufficient enough. They're just a bit too on the small side, so I'm not going to use that. After all that, I'm going to put them back and get a bigger one out. Because I just don't feel like, maybe for 30 by 30, but for this type i feel like i need to use something like this with the good old tic tac containers so let's get our stickers out write them down all the codes this one does not have a funky symbol on it does it have funky symbols? No, it's just alphabetical and numerical, which is good. Rio, stop. He annoys me. He really does annoy me when he starts this. One, it does have the DMC codes on it, but I just can't. You know, after so many, you just get fed up of it. You know, I just go by I now. Five. Seven, and then it goes from from nine it jumps to a b c d e
which is that an eye? I can't really see. Hmm. I think it's an eye. I'm not sure. I'm trying to see. Let's see. H I J K. No, it's not. H, we miss A. Okay, so there's no E. There's no E, so we reuse that on another one. I made a boo boo there. That's A, B, C, D, and then it jumps to F. G, H, and then it jumps to J. Hmm. J, K, and then it jumps to N. N. Q. Q and R. Okay. So what I'm going to do with this one, because they're all lying flat, I've decided to just put this on here like so. I'll probably change my mind about this, but you know. For now, I just can't deal with the problems of it. So I hope you all had a lovely weekend. Mine was very calm, peaceful, didn't do anything, didn't go anywhere, just chilled out, doing some diamond paintings and uh, yeah, you know, it is what it is. It's... Uh, been very 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 wind, wet and windy here in the UK so great for diamond painting really um, my son did have a go at doing his uh, diamond painting and luckily thank god they were all in these tic tac containers because before he'd even started he dropped them, didn't he? The whole tub of these went flying. But thankfully, they were all concealed and not open. Or else it would have been a disaster, really. You know. There. I think I'm going to move you up here so you can see a bit more less of my hands and more of what i'm doing okay so we've got our stickers done so let's go got some beautiful colors on this let's start on number one first so yeah it's just um been a nice peaceful nice peaceful monday so far no dramas but did oversleep. I usually get up at half six and I didn't today. I just couldn't wake up. It's just so, you know, when you're just in that slumber, you're just like, yeah, whatever. I hear you alarm, but I don't want to go off. There we go. So that's number one, all filled up. Yeah, I've done quite a few of these 30 by 30s now. And the lid of that one looks a bit... Hmm. And I thought, you know what? I'm just going to kit up a few of them, get them ready, get them organised, and then just 
go with it, you know. Just get them done. They're just so beautiful, it's just hard to decide which ones to do. You know, because obviously we've got Halloween coming up, but we don't actually celebrate Halloween. Uh, we usually go straight from my son's birthday, September, into Christmas mode, you know. Um, so the kiddies are already thinking about their presents, what they want. Which is good for mummy, because mummy likes to know. But they always do some last minute surprises which uh, does my head in right about a week or so before Christmas they suddenly say oh by the way I want that can you tell Santa quickly please and you're like oh really didn't you tell me that last month <laughs> kids don't you just love them eh they are quite funny though my son's at a really funny age I say funny but yeah it's quite difficult he's now just turned 12 and as i said he is just oh you know kevin the teenager brings to mind it's just a nightmare it's literally i don't know what it is about those uh teenage hormones but they do they just they just changed, didn't they, overnight, really? It's bloody annoying, excuse my language, but, you know, you just think, where's my little boy gone? He's not there no more, I tell you that much. So, but I love him dearly, that's the main thing. Number five is number five. I do love him. Even if they drive us crazy, eh? Joys of being a mum. He said to me last night, Oh, I've got to go to school tomorrow. I really don't want to. You know, this school life is hard. So, well, you know, love, we all have to do things in life that we don't want to do. Do you think I enjoy washing all your clothes? cooking and spending my life cleaning no of course not so, oh sugar there we go do you know what i think i'm just going to use a tray for these be so much easier sometimes my aim is not it's not good so I'd like to know what you all do with your leftover drills because, I mean, I've got so many. I've got a whole box full of leftovers. They're not all D DMC coded because I just sort of collect them and put like the pinks with pinks and that sort of thing. I don't obsess over it. I don't have time for that, you know. But. Because I think if you go by the DMC code, it's never going to be true to itself, really. Because I think every company that you use in China or wherever you get them from, America, they're all going to be using different machines. They're all going to be using, um, like, what's it called? Um just different toners probably different uh, software to make the um the diamond paintings i think we might need two for this one this is number seven and i just think you're just never going to win that game if you go because it, you know most of the time the shades are so different they're not they're not the same they never will be the same and you know 
I'm going to just stress yourself out about DMC codes because they're all different companies at the end of the day, aren't they? So I have seen some YouTubers that just, you know, they, they go and they get all the DMC codes and you think, really? That would drive me insane. We'd be here all day doing that. I don't think this is going to work either, guys. Let me get my little white boat because it's just going to spin out of that one. The white boat is the best one, I find. These with the long spout, they're perfect. Perfect for them um, pouring. I mean, I saw one woman and she'd ordered a whole load of wine no i think it was ab's I'm not mentioning names but she had a scale there for actually measuring out each bag and i thought really i don't have time for that i really don't i'll just take your word for it yeah oh this might go Yes, it does. You might hear a crunch. No, that shocked me, that did. I di really didn't think all of that would go in there. Wow, that's good. Hey, it's really noisy this morning. I do apologise. I've just not long put him back in his cage as well because we just had a little bit of a cuddle. And a little bit of a play fight because he's in a he's in a very very uh, playful mood this morning. And um, yeah, he's, I thought he'd go back in and go to sleep, but clearly, clearly Rio has other ideas. Most definitely, he just does not have the same. The same idea as what I do. He's coming up to five months now. And he's getting louder by the day, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, I'm sure of it. Oh, look at that. I put the number. Put it there. Yeah. Seven. Eight. Yeah, so going back to the old uh, DMC codes, yeah, I, I just, I mean, you know, I've got all respect for people that do sit there and never, ever throw out any of their drills. But, I mean, you're just, you're just collecting stuff for the sake of it then, aren't you, really? Because I, I don't mind having a few spares, but at some point you need to say, right, okay, I've got enough spares now you know, and donate them to the local schools or, you know, the art departments of sorts. Oh, my eyes keep streaming this morning. Number nine. Oh, there is a number ten. Did I not write a number ten? No, number ten. Number 10 is A. That's why I didn't write a number 10. These are just gorgeous. Look at them. These are ABs as well. So they're lovely. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, what's that? Bit of trash in there obviously from the printer did I drop yeah I dropped a couple just two there we go There's A. <sighs> so 
so tired today. Mind you, I did have a bit of a late night trying to get everything organised Monday morning. It's very difficult because I have my three younger ones are in three different schools. So, just trying to remember what has what. So, yeah, it's a bit tricky. But they're all supposed, they're all where they're supposed to be. Praise the Lord for that. So, yeah, my son is uh, quite moody at the moment. My little one has a cold as well, so I'm surprised I haven't sent her home. I thought I might get the phone call, the dreaded phone call that we all dread. Oh, nothing worse than... If you just sat down for a cuppa, the phone goes, oh, you think, no, why? Ooh. Oh, dear, sorry about that. Can't stop yawning this morning. I definitely think Mondays and Fridays are like the two hardest days of the week because the rest of the days you sort of get into a bit of a flow. You know, these are not, uh, yeah, this is not going down the spout. I think they're a bit too big for it. That's why, look, making a right old mess of this. Never mind, never mind. The majority of them got in. <sighs> yeah. You just use the base of your hand to uh, collect them. There's no drama. There. So that is C. D is 13. Yep. Oh, wow. These are gorgeous, gorgeous ones. I just really have a passion for these at the moment, to be honest with you. That's why I thought, you know what, I'm just going to kit quite a few of them up and then just work my way for them all. What am I doing it like that? I don't know if it will actually go through, though, to be fair, because it, they're a bit bigger. <laughs> Than the spout. I do it like a shaky shape. These are another A B ones. I think. Yeah, that's better. If you just give it a little shake. There we go. I was talking to uh, one of my friends earlier. She was saying about the amount of children in her child's class that have some sort of uh, learning needs. Oh, it seems to definitely be on the increase here. But unfortunately, it might be on the increase, but the funding and the money side of it really isn't. Which is not good, not good at all. Because the schools are really having to to struggle with um with these children, you know. And uh unfortunately the other children in the classroom do suffer as well because You know, they have to, they get hit and all the rest of it because that child is uh, not getting his needs met. 
basically it's a, a losing situation for everyone and uh yeah the uh school's hands are tied and i think a lot of people tend to go under the illusion of once your son or daughter has a diagnosis that's it they get everything they really don't you have to fight you have to fight for everything because everyone wants to get the best for their child but the funding just isn't there it really isn't and uh it is a, a worry it really is Anyway, I didn't make it to church yesterday because of this petrol situation. I was worried that I might not be able to get back. No. It's crazy. I think they're bringing the army in or so I've been told today. So hopefully people will stop panic buying and be a bit more responsible with the whole uh, fuel situation. It's not good though. It's not good. These are beautiful as well. These look like they have a touch of something different on top of them as well. Touch of baby. Yeah, I tell you what, fan cells are really pulling out the stops with their diamonds their rhinestone paintings look at that it's gorgeous lots of different uh, shades going on there I do love these bubble ones I must admit they're like my favourite type to do So I'm going to be a godmother at the weekend. I can't believe it. My first godchild. It's such a privilege, such a privilege to do, to have a godchild. So I take that responsibility very seriously. Very seriously indeed. 18 is. Yeah. so it should be lovely it's always nice to go to a christening although my friend's children are actually quite older and I did say to her you're going to find out on Saturday why <laughs> why I chose to have my children christened as babies because it's just so much more easier you know it really is why is this not coming out i think yeah we have a blockage but never mind it's just easier when they're babies isn't it down to the last few now n N is number 19, aqua blue, actually I'm quite impressed with this because I haven't had to use two to, uh, on the same colour yet. Go. Yep. If you see me putting random ones in, I do do that occasionally. Just so that I know I have got some spares in there somewhere. You know, it's no big deal. I'm not fussed when it comes to uh, that sort of thing. How are we doing for time? 29, okay, not too long, not too bad. 
Oh wow, these are gorgeous colour again. Look, look at them. Lovely. Oh, in your hop. There we go. Last one, yay! This is better doing it this way than just pouring them in directly. Absolutely. A lot better there we go that's the last one so we're all kitted up good to go just going to write the canvas number on here and i like to write the image as well so mind you sometimes i'll use the letters the uh, the letters the um sticker on the uh, pack but yeah this one's lost its stick unfortunately let's see if I can do it no no it's not coming off it's stuck down that one so I'll just use another one and I will write the canvas as Z013 and then I'll put so I know that that is for that there we go all set for that one and then what I also do what I will be doing is I shall also just tape up this put some washi tape on it so that it's um ready to start Let me just check see how far over yeah the adhesive has gone quite far over on this image um, okay 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 Trying to just bear with me, just trying to find some washi tape here, guys. There, yeah, that one will do. I don't really, I like to try and get a color that is um, quite similar to the painting so that it all blends in. Oh, look at that, it's got a drill stuck to it. There we go, <laughs> a bit of um. bit of uh, what's it called yeah I don't know what I'm talking about this morning I'm not one of those that measures out by numbers and all that I really just can't do be doing that So I'll just do it in sections like so. Yeah, he's quietened down now, so I think he's getting ready. Bless him for his little, little siesta that he has. So we just have to line it up. Like so. Put 
can uh, come on there we go Yeah, I really feel for the teachers sometimes. I mean, their hands are just so tied with the whole uh, funding situation. There we go. Nearly there now. I and mean, then this one is ready to be started. I used to use clear tape um, at first, but now I always use like um, a bit of coloured washi tape just because, it, you know, it adds to the picture sometimes. Mess that one up. There we go. Nearly there. It's all good to go now. Ta-da! Ready and waiting for me to start. So, there you go. And then what I do is when I'm ready to do it, I just cut along here like so with my handy scissors and just pull it, pull it back like so to that part and that's it that's how i kit up for a diamond painting okay hope you've liked this video please like subscribe and share i try to post videos daily um yeah if you want to see more of my kitting up videos and please let me know i know i waffle on i talk quite a lot about nonsense most of the time but hey ho you know such is life and um yeah hope you have enjoyed this video and speak to you soon hope you all have a lovely beautiful monday the sun is just coming out and uh, stay blessed stay happy stay safe and god bless you all bye